guys, my new merch came in and it looks good. It's a little small, uh, but that's my fault. I didn't read the sizing chart of my own merch. Regardless, I think it came out awesome. The quality is nice. It's really soft. If you guys are interested in picking up some for yourself, link in the description. I really appreciate the support. Y'all are awesome. Let's get into the video. Minecraft inside of a bed. You guys are crazy. How do you guys come up with this stuff? I wish I was as smart as you. Why didn't I think of that? That's amazing. Ooh. Oh my God. My dreams have come true. It looks so good. Oh. So obviously we can't make a house inside of a, a real bed because it's an entity. It's two different blocks. It's a little complicated, but we can make it look practically the same. I'll show you what I mean. Let's get into the town and get it on. Of course it's raining weather go away all right so let's first start off with the normal bed design let's check it out where could we put it there is space here you know what no let's do it over here new real estate baby i mean let's try to break into the bed obviously doesn't work it's a little bit of an issue but no need to fear we will do it and it's gonna be great there's definitely enough space to get up inside and walk into the bed so that's perfect i need to take these Poles. I gotta make more of them. I gotta extend the town. The one thing I didn't do last episode. Uh-oh. Okay, let's just do this. One, two, three. Boom. You guys have been giving me nothing but good ideas. See what I did there? I <laughs> made you freak out for a little bit. Honestly, all of your ideas that you guys leave in the comments have helped me so much decide what I should do next. So thank you everyone for that. The bed was a freaking classic idea. I wish I thought of it. And for right now, let's just do one more. That is not what I meant to place. There we go. Perfect. So we need to figure out what block we can use for the base. Obviously the top of the bed, red wool, duh. And the pillow of the bed, white wool, duh. Uh, but we're gonna have to figure out what, what can we do? What best matches this? I don't know. Maybe the retextured wood planks. Hmm. Honestly, oak wood doesn't look that bad. I must ponder this. I have no idea. I want to say yes to the dress, but I can't. What? Do I have to make a whole other block? I, I don't want to. I mean, I, I might, but I feel like we could find a workaround for this. All right, you might be thinking, Bandy, you're crazy. I don't know how that an oak log could work, but if we do it like that, if you think about it, it's not that bad. If we do it sideways, we'll see how it looks. I'm gonna start mining this out, the legs of it. Let's see, one, two, three, that's all it takes. One, two, three, boom, I can see this working. <laughs> yes, hmm. Quite. I need my saw. Where is it? There she is. All right. Let's bring it down a little bit. And you know what? I'm just going to delete that one. Bring this over here. Put it here. That, it could work. I'm seeing it already. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, no. Oh, yeah. There we go. It does not look the same at all. I don't know how I'm going to get that texture. It's close enough. Wait, can we use pistons? Can we use normal pistons? I don't think so, but we can try. It won't let us. Dang. After a long and hard thought, I think that oak planks, the ones that I retextured for the chest house, were probably the best texture for this. So I went ahead and retextured spruce to look like oak. But for some reason, I made this house out of spruce. It doesn't look that right, but I don't think it really matters. This is probably the best, the best we're gonna get, in my opinion. And we're gonna shrink it down, make some more little stubs, and we're on our way to making this bed. Yes. This is it. Okay, so I also need a, one here and here. <laughs> oh God, this is gonna be fun. I'm probably going to need to make a staircase into the bed house, but for now, I think it'll be fine. I just wanna get the actual shape and then the rest, it'll, it'll be pretty easy, I think. If anyone has any thoughts during the build, let me know down in the comments below what type of house should I make next? The possibilities are endless. Yeah. All right, well, if you didn't know what a bed would look like without any of the mattress, this is what it looks like. I know, it's crazy. Pretty ugly, to say the least. I need some red wool and some white wool. So our two sources right here. I think I'm gonna start with the pillow, the best part of the bed, some may say. All right, it's not gonna look exact. This is how a bed would look if Minecraft was true to its textures, which it is not, but that's okay because it, it kind of looks better without it being wool. There it is. Can you even tell the difference? Probably. <laughs> this is our bed, baby. What everyone has been waiting for. The staircase. Into our beautiful palace. All right. So 
What is that? Why, why does that look different? Might be the shading. I'm not too sure on why it looks so weird, but we're just going to continue. Oh, yes, it is beautiful. All right. And then this should be our doorway. I hope I fit. Please fit. Please. If I don't, I might need to extend the bed a little bit because we're so close. Dang it. Wait a minute. Hold on. I got to undo this re just real quick. I want to extend every part up just by one block so that we may actually enter the house. <laughs> ha ha. Yes. <laughs> Thank God. Okay. Well, this is going to be quite a spacious house. Usually I only do one block, uh, but this bed actually takes up two. If you didn't know that, uh, then you're not a true Minecrafter. But regardless, there's going to be a lot of space in here. I'm gonna have to figure out what I can do. Maybe I can make a painting. Uh, maybe add a little wall that's like a bookshelf like I did over in the uh, diamond block house. I haven't decided quite yet, but um, the excavation process may take a bit. I'm so excited for this. I've always wanted to live in a bed. Just never get out. Just always sleep in my bed and never leave. Especially when my mom would wake me up, tell me to go to school. No, mom. I want to live here in my bed and never leave. Especially if it means I have to go to school. Relatable. Oh, God. I've grown. I wish there was a way to make the potion infinite, but I've, dude, I've tried so many times and it's impossible. It's just that the mod itself doesn't have enough functionality. Oh God, I've mined through. We have a little bit more space. Wait a minute. Am I going to have to put a bed inside my bed? What? This is going to be some next level building. <laughs> oh my God. I've just now realized that this is just mind boggling stuff here. We are truly breaking through to the next level. I might truly go insane. I just pushed this wall back just a little bit and it made this cute little window and I kind of like it. It's kind of ugly. Hold on. Maybe we can make it a little bit better. Maybe it doesn't have to be that crazy. That's not bad. <laughs> That's not that bad. I like it. It's very intriguing. Oh yeah. Now I can just take chunks out, baby. Okay. Not that big of a chunk. Let's not get ahead of ourselves now. That's just a little bit too much. I hate always oh, accidentally breaking the edge of my house. You ever do that? Me either. Not in reality, but in Minecraft. Specifically this part of Minecraft. Oh, wait. Oh, can I do this? Ooh, okay. I might just need to fill in the walls here. What happened to my ceiling? See, that's the issue with taking out these big chunks. You never know what you're going to take out. Yes, 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 yes. I know. I'm going to go back and fix that. Don't worry. Boom. And then outside because I messed up. Yeah. Okay, that's the wall. And that's the wall. Nice. Okay. So can I like... No. Dang it. <laughs> wait a minute. Do I dare just build like this? And then I can use my saw, kind of. Oh no, I'm gonna have to go outside for this. I'm gonna go into the hole and extend it down. Oh yeah, there's something just so relaxing about this. Oh wait, I can duplicate this. What? 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 I didn't know you could do that. Look at, you could like, hold on. If I hold shift and click, you can duplicate the entire block. What? I didn't know that. Oh my God, look at this. Wait, hold on. Hold on, I messed that up. Look it! I can place as many grass block houses as I want. Look it. It has the window and everything inside of it and everything. Oh my god. That's awesome, dude. What? That's just the coolest thing I've seen all day. There's just no way around it. God, I wish I knew that before. This town's about to get a whole lot more interesting. <laughs> okay. Yeah, it is. All right, let's get rid of this sunroof. This bed is not supposed to have this. Yes. Noise. This is looking so good. Looks like the bed house is completely weatherproof. Thank God. Uh, I just need to break out these. Oh my God. That was loud. I need to break out these little corners and then... Mm, yes, the entirety of the house is complete. Window, staircase and all. All right. So I want more dirt block houses. I'm going to put another one just so the bed house doesn't feel alone because, oh God, how do I rotate it around? Okay. I'll put it right here. How about that? An entire remake of the grass block house right here. Looking good, dude. Looking sick. I'm actually going to break the floor. Stupid skeleton. Get out of here. Oh my God. What? How did I one tap him? That was crazy. I'm going to take the, the floor because I like, I like the dirt texture. It really looks Makes it look like it's inside of a block. Boom, baby. Yeah. Wait, did I do that right? Oh, no. I messed it up by one freaking block. My guy. Nice. We did it. Yeah. All we need is a, a little cutout for the road. And we're on our way. Yes, dude. So cool. This mod has got so much cooler. Uh, I bit my lip or my cheek. What? Same thing, dude. Ah, God, that hurt. Why can't I set these on fire? That's weird. What about this one? No, you can't. Can't set little blocks on fire. Kind of weird. All right, you guys know what's next, right? The bed inside of the bed. This, this is going to be pretty easy. We're going to put this in the corner back here. <laughs> oh my God, dude. This is going to be so cool. Oh wait, every time, dude. Every single time. There we go. Yes, I should I should not have put it next to the wall. We have so much space. We're going to be a little liberal. Just a little bit. 
And now, for the finishing touches. That's a bed inside of a bed! What have I done? Have we pushed science too far? Let me know down in the comments. Because I think we have. This is outrageous. I need to go get some glass. Now I will run back. Because I need I need to fill the window, you know? Make it look a little bit a little bit cooler. Nice. You can't even you can't even tell that there's glass there unless you come inside. But hey, it's good. I'm I'm cool with it. If you're cool with it. Pretty sick. Okay, where is my library? No, no, no. Oh, I'm sorry. It was in the TNT house. That's where it was, dude. Oh, yeah. And these turned into chest things because we retextured oak. We're going to replace it with spruce, which now looks like oak and oak looks like chest. Are you guys keeping up? <laughs> oh, my God. It looks so good, dude. It looks so good. I'm going to steal that texture while we're here. Which wall should we make a library? I think I'm thinking not the whole thing. We don't need to go crazy with it, Um, but just like a little little section here. We'll do this. Carve out a little section of nowhere. Nice. And then library. Why does this not look like books? Okay, there we go. The top looks like it's oak as well. So does that one. Oh my God. Dang it, dude. That looks weird. It looks more like a book fridge than a bookshelf or like a book fireplace. <laughs> I like it. Let's keep it. It looks pretty nice. What else can we add? Definitely the crafting tables and chests, all that good stuff. Uh, now that I know how to freaking take the whole square. Oh, wait, no, that's the whole house. Dang it. We'll take the chest first. Pop this bad Larry in here. Oops, wrong thing. Chest. Mm-hmm. Boom. All right, now for the other two. The other two are easy. Easy peasy to copy. Yes, dude. This is looking so good. And now the crafting boy. Woo! I wish that other blocks would be functional like the crafting table because it's so cool how it's like a small crafting table and I can just right click it and do whatever I want. That's sick. If only the furnace could do that, man. Shout out to whoever made the mod. Make it better. I know you can. You're a smart guy. Clearly, it's way smarter than I. Okay, I just carved out a path for like the pathway to the house and it literally fixed the, the shading bug with the stairs. I don't know what that was about, but we fixed it. So good on them. We're living lavish. Oh my God, dude. This is just looking so freaking good. I just love everything about this house. I know I've said it before, but this one, this is my favorite. Look at it. It's just homey. There's something about it. it makes me happy. I love it. That's so cool, dude. Literally one of the coolest builds. Has to be. All right, so there was a comment in my last video that said that I should make a bridge on this connection. I made it out of dirt uh, last episode, but someone said make like a bridge. And then I said, what if I made it into like the Golden Gate Bridge? See where I'm going with this? This is going to be sick if I can pull it off, that is, which I might might be able to. Too soon to tell, but I just love that idea. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to make this flush with the road. And I'm going to look up a picture of the Golden Gate Bridge and we're going to freaking build it to the best of my ability. We might use red wool. Let's see. Oh, wait, we could use red concrete. Oh, yeah, that's, that's going to look way better. Hold on, I need to find a picture first. I don't know what I'm modeling after. I mean, I know the shape kind of, but I need a reference for sure. Okay. All right. That looks good. I like that. Okay. <laughs> I don't know how we're going to do that. That's the fun part, you know? All right. I think if we do two layers like that, that's what we're just going to, we're going to start with this and we're just going to go from there. It's a pretty deep ravine. Like you see how the legs go into the water. I think we're just going to scratch that part, but we're still going to have those, those tall towers that have the, uh, the lines going and connecting. Oh yeah. It's going to be good. Sheep do not ruin my bridge. What are you doing? Oh, oh, that was so cute. The sheep just ate the grass. That was awesome. All right, that's looking pretty nice. I think we should carve a little bit into the, uh, just a little tiny bit into the grass. I think it'll look nice. Uh oh. Oh, there we go. Okay, that worked. And we'll do the same on this side. There we go. And there we go. Awesome. <laughs> this is gonna look so good. Okay, so on the sides of the bridge, it like starts fat and then gets mad skinny. And then there's things in the middle connecting them. So what I'm gonna do, I have like this tower here we'll go up like that wait wait hold on i think i already messed it up there we go and then it's gonna no wait one more one more ready you'll see it's all up here it's... the cogs are turning don't worry and then it goes up a little bit higher and then it goes to that's not the block then it goes to these one two three four five six seven I'm not gonna toot my own horn but that's... that looks pretty good already and I'm just going to duplicate what I do best. Oh my God, that was so easy to do. All right, now I just need to connect these. Actually, I'm going to do, I can't even walk in between them unless I'm small. Then it works fine. I'm going to duplicate them on this side. How many do I do? I don't know if it's going to be mathematically correct, but it'll look sick. Dude, this is going to look so good. I think I should put a second layer underneath. It looks a little flat right now. We'll just push that out right in and we'll go 
we're gonna push it across like that very very good oh <gasps> ooh, okay that looks even better i'm just gonna keep it we're just rolling with the punches today oh that look good oh yeah now we just gotta make the connections there's four it looks like but i don't know if we have to be exactly accurate as long as we get the basic shape i think it'll be fine i think we should just do it every time it gets smaller we'll just make a little connection piece that'll be fine no one will tell the difference <laughs> Oh, wait, I just had a great idea. Because it's so pointy at the top, should we do it like that? Probably. Yeah, it looks good. It'll be so nice when it's done. All right, so I had to extend the uh, base of it, th these two, like, red connections, because the, the wires go up, and then they swoop down and connect, and then they go back down. So I'm going to have to figure out how to do that now. What I'm going to do is probably make it like that so it looks, like, pretty organic. And, uh, yeah, we'll go from there. This is going to take a little bit. <laughs> So uh, I'm just gonna fast forward. All right, it doesn't look the best, but you get the idea. Maybe I just need to probably just extend them out a little bit. It's a little bit longer. Oh God, what have I done? Oh yes, dude. I think this is the design. This is the exact shape that it should be. Yes, it's not perfect, but I think it looks pretty good. I think that's as good as we're gonna get it. All right, I completed the, the swoops. They're not the best, okay? They're not exact. It's not to scale either, so don't judge me, but it's pretty good. <laughs> it looks gorgeous sitting above the pit of really dark stone. And the only thing left I have to do is the pillars that connect, and then we're pretty much done. So we're gonna do that. Speed run, go! Yes, it is complete. The golden freaking gate bridge. This was my brainchild. Thanks whoever said in the comments that I should build a bridge because then I would never have had this idea and it, it doesn't look the best. Not gonna lie, it's not the greatest, but it's good. I think it's a great addition to this world. Let me know what else I should add to the world down in the comments below. But I think that is all the time that I have for today. Thank you guys so much for watching. Like I said, merch in the description. It's great quality, uh, and it really does help me. Thank you guys so much. I'll see you in the next episode. Later!